Hey guys, welcome back to Bikes and Bud. I'm Chris, and today we're going to be doing another carving. Um, I put up a video this morning of me carving this here spoon, which I've since um, cleaned up the handle a little bit better, and I've sanded it down. Um, maybe I scooped it out a little bit better anyways, but here's a better look at that spoon. Um, somebody in the comments of this video told me that I should carve a fork to go with it. Um, and since it looks like it's going to be a rainy weekend where I'm not going to get out on the bike or anything, I think I'm going to try to carve a fork. Um, so before we get started, I'm going to show you what I'm going to use. So I have this 2x2x8 two by two by piece of um, pine here. It used to be 8 feet, but it's just been, this is what I got left. Um, so I'm going to cut it here. I think that was 6 inches I marked it at. Uh, I don't have a template or anything. I may draw something on it before I get slicing, but I don't know. So, um, yeah, gonna make a fork. This is what I have to use. Um, I'll also be using my um, three and a quarter Sloyd uh, knife um, from Beavercraft. I don't know if we can get that to focus. Um, Beavercraft is on the lower end of your carving tools, um, but they work well for me. Uh, I haven't had any issues with them so far. I've been super happy. They're, de <laughs> they're definitely sharp enough to cut yourself because I've done that a few times. And they're actually made in the Ukraine. And um, from what I understand, uh, the company is in Kiev. So that's, that's interesting. Um, so I have the Sloyd knife, three and a quarter Sloyd. This guy out. I also have from Beavercraft for a little bit finer work. I have this uh, one and a quarter roughing knife. <coughs> so that's what I'll be using. Um, besides that, to saw off our piece of wood, hey buddy, just to make it a little more fun and a little more authentic. I'll be using the saw on my trusty Swiss Army knife. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to set you guys up. Um, probably going to start speeding you guys ahead and just watch this fork take place or watch it bomb, one or the other. But hope you stay tuned and check it out.
Alright guys, and uh, I don't know how long exactly that took to carve out, um, I think about 50-55 minutes, um, but I mean, it did come from a chunk of 2x2, two two, and I carved the whole thing with 3 quarter, 3 and a quarter sloyd, and a 1 and 1 quarter rough out, a little bit of 220 sand, that's it. So, uh, yeah, anything else you guys want me to give it a shot? I'm having a lot of fun with this, so uh, if you have any ideas, just drop them in the comment, and if I think it's possible um, for me to do it, then I will give it a shot. So until next time, guys, keep carving. I don't know. Have fun.